안녕하십니까 안녕하세요 어, 이번에 아트워브 3년 3주년 기념으로 어, 이렇게 기념품들도 집을 받았는데요 이게 보면은 이제 아이방과 아서인데 태엽 군인들의 미니 등신대를 보내주셨어요 너무 귀엽고요 예. 또 이거는 아이방과 드레이크의 공격 장면을 보여주는 조명등이라고 해야 되겠죠? 조명등인데요 이 불빛이 이렇게 납니다 너무 귀여운 걸 보내주셨어요 이번에 그리고 요거는 우리 아트 오브 기념 주화인데 제 생각에 아마도 코클에서 먼저 만들었던 코클 코인을 감명을 받고 만들지 않았을까 라는 저만의 개인적인 생각이 듭니다 아무튼 이렇게 3주년 기념 분들을 저에게 보내주셔서 정말 감사드리고요 아 그리고 아트 오브 기념 티셔츠 네, 3주년 기념으로 3이라는 큰 숫자가 써있고요 기본적인 병사들이 있고 너무 귀엽네요 근데 사이즈를 먼저 물어보셨는데 좀 작습니다 많이 작아가지고 좀 조금 끼는데 아 그래도 감사합니다 그리고 마스크도 보시면은 여기에 아트오브의 로고가 있는 마스크를 받았는데 제가 머리가 커가지고 마스크가 좀 작네요 네 저는 코클의 찰스라고 합니다 네 저의 목적은 한국입니다 네, 제 직업은 차량의 부품 품질을 담당하고 있습니다 네, 앞서 말씀드린 것처럼 저는 KOR 클랜 코클이며 멤버들, 코클 멤버들과는 요즘에 코로나 시국에서 많이 만나지 를 못하는데 음, 정모를 좀 자주 했으면 좋겠고 자주 만나서 술 한잔 하면서 게임 내용 외에도 그냥 사는 얘기들도 나누면서 그런 모임을 좀 자주 하고 싶네요 Again, my in-game name is Hobbs. I live in Texas, in the United States of America. I am currently in the Casa Clan. I started with Dom. They picked me up off of a Facebook post and sent me a, a request to join. Uh, we merged with Lat, and then I left them to join Royal. We did many fun seasons with Royal. Uh, and finally, here recently, we merged with Rip and retired the Royal brand. which uh, made us the Crown and Skull Alliance. So currently I play for CASA. I am in the Rus clan, the most powerful team of Russian players. Apart from that, the Rus clan is in the union of Russian clans with the name of the Zemsky Sabor. We called it in honor of the event of 1612, when the Russian opponent was able to learn from our country and foreign interventions. 어 제가 한 2년 2년 조금 넘었을 것 같아요. 정확한 시기는 잘 기억이 안 나고 일단은 그 인게임 내에서 2주년 기념 아이템을 받은 걸로 봤을 때한 2주년 2년은 조금 넘지 않았나 그렇게 생각하고 있습니다. Uh, this I think is the same for most of us uh, during 2020 and COVID shut down uh, much of the world as we know it. I enjoyed playing racquetball and being very active and uh, the world stopped doing all that so I was left to watch television and play video games. Uh, I picked up Art of War through an ad that they had run uh, and I've been playing ever since. I played a little bit more than two and a half years ago when in Moscow, in Russia, they announced quarantine because of the terrible disease COVID-19. И стало много свободного времени. Случайно э, тыкнул в, в рекламу, где были человечки. Кстати, самое интересное, что большинство игроков, с которыми я разговаривал, ровно таким же образом мы пришли в нашу игру. Mm, 제 생각에는 뭐 유저마다 성향 차이가 있겠지만 한국인들에게는 조금 좀 편한 게임인 것 같아요. 어, 인게임 내에서도 뭔가 다 같이 협동해서 하는 것보다도 다 개인적인 게임이 더 많고 개인적인 컨텐츠가 더 많고 그렇다고 해서 게임 안에서 밀접해서 뭔가를 하는 것보다도 그 웹적으로 사람들과의 소통이 더 많은 것 같, 같아서 그런 부분이 가장 좋은 것 같아요. 뭔가 유저들과의 대화를 더 많이 해야 되고 소통이 됨으로써 더 좋은 성과를 얻을 수 있는 그런 점이 되게 좋은 것 같습니다. 
Uh, I like the creativity of the game. I enjoy the animations. I enjoy the uh, the play of Arena. But mostly, uh, I think I enjoy the interaction with the community. I enjoy meeting people from other cultures, uh, especially within Clan, where we can chat nightly and I can hear about their lives in different parts of the world. I think the uh, the community is probably the best aspect. Больше всего мне нравится это общение с людьми, строительство клана, установление контактов с ребятами из других команд, из других стран, из других международных объединений. Ну и что касается самого игрового процесса, то это, конечно, стратегическое мышление, ресурсов всегда мало. Клен, Корея клени, и вон и идем, сам дым, и кесом людей, а мензо, воракая. Он чем на сон джанг, и кесом хаку и цельте, крутые чум манин, и занял падаку. Куре это мод, харанге, манчиман, чем и занял нанин гонин, ури кукре, хайчони, чем джам джам, сон джанг и ганин босс, и кем джанг и занял джаг ята, нагу мессимуль тюрьзи и кенео. And yes, that that's kind of a sad story, but yes, there was. And uh, when I started with Royal, there was a player called Satman. Uh, he's a nice guy. I didn't interact with him a ton, but I did interact with him. We, we shared forums and we talked and we uh, played on Discord in the game together. Uh, and then one day they told me he had died. He had had a heart attack and uh, with a young daughter and a family and, and he had died unexpectedly. And uh, in my profession, you see a lot of deaths, so it it uh, it struck me as odd that it affected me as sadly as it did. Like I was really, uh, I was pretty emotional over it for a little bit, uh, and I reconciled with myself how much the community means to me, how much these players that I interact with, uh, how much I have invested in their lives, uh, wishing them the best, and and hearing that something bad happened to one of the players. Uh, it just left me with a with a, a feeling that that the community as a whole was important. The community as a whole was important. So uh, I think that left a deep impression on me to be kind to everyone I meet and to uh, be respectful of everyone I meet and hope that everyone has uh, joy and happiness in their lives. Вы знаете, такого вот, чтобы прям в одну секунду что-то меня сильно впечатлило, такого не было. Но на протяжении всех э, двух с половиной лет моей игры у меня э, возникает радостное чувство и очень позитивные эмоции от того, какое огромное количество хороших, интересных, умных, поразительно добрых людей мне удалось встретить благодаря этой игре. В обычной жизни я тоже очень общительный человек, но здесь... Э, Количество людей, с которыми я контактирую, конечно, очень большое. И я очень рад того, что мои изначальные ощущения, что хороших людей намного больше, чем плохих в жизни, наша игра только подтверждает. Most nights I choose to play in my office uh, at home, where I have my computer and my phone, and I can watch Discord, where we get on voice and chat with Casa other CASA members, and uh, we have as much fun every night as we can from the game playing Arena Hour together. Well,特徵位置는,我来说,特徵된空间的发展,我们在学习的空间里面,我们在学习的空间里面,我们在学习的空间里面,我们在学习的空间里面,我们在学习的空间里面,我们在学习的空间里面,我们在学习的空间里面
с кем-то мы регулярно встречаемся в обычной жизни. Поэтому никого не хочу обидеть, никого не хочу выделить. Хочу сказать только одно. Ребята, все, кто говорит по-русски, все, кто к нам хорошо относится, я вам все желаю победы, удачи на арене, в игре и больших свершений в обычной жизни. Потому что все-таки обычная жизнь у нас тоже у всех остается. Wow, what a setup that would be. It's been uh, two and a half years almost at the game, and if I mention any one player without mentioning all the players, I am going to be in a lot of trouble. So I'm going to cheat here, and I'm going to give a shout out to everybody. I'm going to say, if you're playing the game and you're part of our community, then I give a shout out to you, all of you, uh, from every clan. <sighs> that... Uh, That's an interesting question. I think I would be Allie, uh, because even though she's a female and I'm a male, I like the idea that she nukes a third of the enemy army at any given time. It's almost like a superhero kind of power. And that would be really cool if people made you upset, you could just drop a bomb on them and get rid of a third of their army every time. So I think she would be a fun person to be. Uh, my occupation is firefighter. Uh, for the first 15 years, I ran into burning buildings. And then for the last 15 years, I thought it was wiser if I let younger people run into burning buildings. So I have been managing uh, here recently as a deputy chief where I run one of the operations shift for our city. <coughs> yeah, that's a uh, given. Our work shift is 24 hours on and we get 48 hours off. So during that period, We are allowed leisure activities as long as it doesn't interfere with my job functions or emergency response. Uh, so I do occasionally play at work. Uh, those times have caused me to miss uh, arena fights. I've had to end early. I've had to leave unexpectedly. Uh, obviously, the job takes precedence whenever it's emergency response. Uh, obviously, there are. I'm not sure how many of them Uh, the community would be interested in. Obviously, being in Royal at the time of the split where RGR left was probably one that I talk about most with other players. Uh, you know, I enjoyed everyone that was in Royal at the time, and uh, I felt like my family uh, was part of a divorce. My mom and dad got divorced, and they made me pick between which side I loved the most. So I feel like that was an interesting era for me to play in. Uh, because then people that I considered close and uh, personal friends were also now my rivals in another clan. And uh, we competed for player resources and for forms and for knowledge, and it was interesting. I am in the Soviet Union, and my main goal is the external relations of our union, and also the relationship with the administration of the game. Самая главная моя задача – это помогать всем игрокам, которые обращаются ко мне за помощью. Делаю я это с большим удовольствием, и это одна из самых интересных составных частей игры для меня самого. Вы знаете, арена, конечно, безусловно, намного интереснее. Почему? Я игрок командный. Для меня мое собственное место, конечно, имеет значение, но намного важнее, где находится моя гильдия, на какой позиции. И арена – это самая конкурентная среда в игре, которая существует. Именно под нее, прежде всего, мы все создаем свои армии, рассчитываем ресурсы для защиты, для атаки. Поэтому это самая, наверное, эмоционально нагруженная часть игры. Очень сложно предугадать, что будет через три года. Мы не знаем, что будет через три месяца. Но мне очень хотелось бы верить, что игра сохранит эм, те позитивные свойства, которые у нее есть сейчас. А это, прежде всего, способность э, к объединению людей, к их контактам. Uh, and then lastly, I will say happy birthday to Art of War on your third anniversary. And I will say I wish you nothing but happiness and joy. And may everyone out there share in that happiness and joy as we move forward into this third year of gameplay. So thank you very much for your time, and I hope you enjoyed the interview.